Hey guys, it's Erica. We're gonna be checking out Each e Young's Let's Dance. So so excited for this. You know we are deeply invested into Cheyun and everything that she does. So really excited to be checking this out, seeing what she's doing for this one. Knock crazy. That was such a good concept and just good all around. But I wanted to see if this is just a single or if she got some B-sides, because if there are, you know what that means. It's just a single. Ooh, but we got two other songs. We got Shangri-La and Cave. I don't know if I'm gonna do a first listen. I don't really do first listens for single albums, but I do, like if it's like a mini album, like that's a good amount, but then I don't know, she's also gonna drop other stuff for these other songs. Um, so yeah, so maybe not a first listen for this one. Um, just, I don't know, like I, it has to be at least three songs that I check out for me to, to see if it's worth, worth it, cause it, and it's also an intro, so like, yeah. But, um, but either way, really excited to be checking this out, no idea what to expect for this comeback, but I love her concepts, I love her music overall, again, we are deeply invested over here, so yes but and I, don't worry girl we can check out those b-sides on my own time don't you worry um but yeah really excited so you know what it like oh wait did she do ballet look at the all white blue hair red shoe love maybe she did she doing great girl i know ballet be hard <laughs> Hey, put on the Jordans. It's so litty. Ooh, purple and orange. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 Dancing Queen. Oh. Love this. Hey. Hey, little shuffle. Let's go. Okay, camera. Hey, camera. Chill out. Talk about that forward. Nice. The way they shoot her choreography is so sick. Same thing with Nog. And I feel like they know exactly what to do. Like, they know they're going to go for a lower angle, wider, this little moment. Extremely well shot choreography. Match cut for the win. Little bird. Hey, okay, okay. Slay, slay, slay. <laughs> That's cute. There's not a lot of space to move, girl, but slay the shuffles. Hey, kill it. I like how the skeleton is everywhere. Great. Love it. Ooh, great legs. It is fun. The camera going kind of crazy like that, but very, like, hard, look like, hits with it. It is fun. I love it. Ooh. Oh, we can dance all night. Oh yeah, this is fun. I love this. Slow mo, slow it down. Ooh, oh, dancing queen. Yeah. Nice. Match cut's crazy. Come on. Speaking of the match cuts, hello. Slay. I love that! That was so good! Let's dance. 
I think the song is really great. It seems to be definitely kind of like Chan's promoting sound and love it so, so much. It was really great. The visuals were super fun. I really liked it. Um, it just kind of all has her kind of look that she's really done recently, especially for like the last two ones. I get it now. I get Chan. Um, but yeah, no, the, the way they shot the choreography is so sick because it's very interesting, right? Because it does go for like a lower angle, which kind of happened with Knock, but um, so like going for that lower angle, it's very interesting. This choreography does not always look the best when it's from like a lower angle. Like sometimes, the, in, like I would say in a, a general rule for choreography is center and above a little bit, just like a, a signature kind of like you're gonna get what you need from the choreography out of that type of camera work. But no, they go for like a lower angle, which works so well and the choreography looks so good from that way. But also I'm assuming it's a robot arm. It has to be because they go for these very kind of like jarring movements that are like very quick and they're very kind of like hard hitting. And it's very interesting because most of the time just in general, but it's not jarring. It's just like kind of like a very jarring movement because most of the time Everybody in like camera world always wants like the very smooth camera movements and very smooth kind of angles, but no, it goes for a little bit more of like a, a little bit more of a punch there and it looked so sick. I really loved it. I loved how they shot the choreography entirely. Every time they were showing the choreography, it looked like the camera was the perfect angle to see the choreography. And not everything does that. Sometimes there are like for like most, um, performance shot type of stuff it goes for kind of just like a general type of look and then it had like maybe some special shots but just kind of just general type of stuff but no i loved what they did here and how every single time the choreography was shown it was the perfect angle for the choreography i think we need more of this in k-pop um just because like not everything is always shot in this way but when it's when it's a wide it's giving you wide and you're seeing the footwork and you're seeing everything when it's closer when it's tighter on her you see you're seeing what you need to see and i think it was absolutely fantastic has to be probably one of the best cases of camera work I've seen in terms of capturing choreography in general in general because every single frame was what it needed to be what it needed to be and I absolutely love that um and I wish every every choreography was shot this way but they really knew what they were doing and there was a lot of attention and a lot of effort put into that and it was so worth it I loved it I think the visual sets were really cool each set was like very kind of different feeling but it all kind of worked together and they were killing those match cuts I mean if you can do it then go ahead and do it and if they are using a robot arm sometimes because sometimes I'm like, what is a robot arm? And then I see it behind the scenes on TikTok or something, and it's it's the same guy, same camera operator, I swear to God, holding this like handheld rig and he's doing all these crazy movements that I'm like, what in the hell? Just because like working in the film and television industry, I'm like, no, it's a certain rig. I'm like, girl, she's a giraffe arm, she's a techno crane, she's a, a pursuit vehicle, it is something like that. Nah, girl, it's just a homie with the camera just going like this. Uh, but yeah, but I would assume, especially with those hard kind of angles that it would be more that it could have been him and then they kind of fixed it in post but uh yeah no that it was really sick so I love the effort being put towards that and um the editing was also fantastic it was really fun as well I love it I think it was so fantastic I love it it's another great comeback every single comeback she gets better and better I don't know how but it happens and I love it. It was fun. It was upbeat. I feel like it also is very fitting for like her personality because I see some of her stuff pop up on TikTok, like some variety content from her, and I'm just like, the math is math thing for me. I love it. I think it's fantastic. Choreography looked amazing, like the best you could ever make a choreography look, and uh, the visuals were really stunning. Match cuts go crazy, uh, and I also love that they did that because I don't know. We don't really get match cuts a whole lot these days, so something that is just so like somebody like okay, there's like a um, in like Premiere, there's like a multi cam view edit, and then you just kind of just got hit like two or three buttons, and then just. Edit. It's a really easy way to edit um, if you have like multiple sort of angles like that that you want to match cut or depending on what you're doing um, But yeah, so it was fantastic song so fun. Love it visuals crazy choreography amazing 
Really, really loved it. Another fantastic comeback from Chaeyoung. Go to your thoughts and comments down below to that about each Chaeyoung's. Let's dance. If you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. If you liked me and you want to see more of my videos, go and hit that subscribe button. If you want to see my videos the second they come out, hit that notification button. If you want to follow me on social media, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, threads, or description down below, or at the end screen. If you like gaming content, I have a gaming channel. It's called Erica Just Games. Links in the description down below. Currently playing Red Dead Redemption 2. I hope you can join me over there for that. Thank you guys so much for watching. Love you and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.